yeah, it's actually really easy content to make now. I just uh, watch Rudy's videos and read the comments, and they're great. They're much more creative than anything I can come up with, to be honest, and they're hilarious. So Rudy's most recent video, Magic Market Looks Great, is being absolutely <laughs> demolished. The Magic Market is not good right now. The liquidity, again... A lot of these prices he's using, I know he knows that they're not real prices. Real price is what you take home. It's not, you know, like like I said, it's just like the Rudy promos. He thinks they're super valuable promos. And some of these promos haven't sold in six or nine months, right? So, like, great. Good luck trying to sell them because no one wants them. But anyway, let's uh, read. Rudy yesterday. MetaZoo was not an investment. Stages exit. Rudy today. Magic's doing great. Magic has to be consistent for at least a year to change the minds of so many people that have been shafted by the mass reprints in the past four years. Pokemon is as solid as it's always been. 909. This is the face Rudy makes when he's trying his hardest to convince you that Magic is thriving. <laughs> Rudy is so plugged up, just like all of our stepsisters, after they look at the receipt when he leaves. I remember this guy analyzing MetaZoo charts on the mini spikes. This guy will never told anyone to get out of MetaZoo until it was $20 a box. Someone like CoffeeZilla needs to expose this guy. Or Carl Jobs. So that's kind of where we're probably heading because I have another channel and it's the lawyer channel. And I think it's interesting because he it was a pump. I mean, MetaZoo, if it does go to zero and does go bankrupt, yeah, you can be sure that I'll make a video on my other channel. I do like the TCG player graph of Phyrexia Collector from 175 to 210, a collector box in a month. There is a small movement there. Patron, hey Rudy, how come MTG is going up now, both new sealed and reserve list? Rudy, well, Timmy, all those MetaZoo evil investors are now back into MTG. The more Rudy exaggerates, the faster he talks. I like this take coming out after admitting last week someone bought the mountain of garbage to prop up the market. But oh, wait, that means everything is great. I'll keep waiting, thanks. Draft boxes need to be around 89 to be successful if you're paying $15 a month for a Rudy sub anyway. Rudy, Magic is doing great. Patreon members, cool story, bro. And if you look at your left, you see a dead count cat bouncing off a dead horse. This is the side of Rudy's content that is just straight up bullshit. I wonder how this is going to AIDS, good time to buy alpha. Never seen so much alpha not in 10 years. One week Wizard of Coast are evil devils destroying magic. The next week magic is doing great with the same people in charge. Which one is it, Rudy? I guess it's time for the wizards are genius part of the new cycle. And then a money emoji. Magic needs to rebound for the long term health of the game. That said, I'm not in a rush to see it. I'm slowly buying the singles I need for decks and the reserve list cards that I want for collections and decks. You're too brutal. He knows, we know, everyone knows things aren't great. He's trying to save some face. We probably would too. I didn't realize how many people hate Watts. Anyone else here that actually likes the guy? I think he's funny. No one ever said looks can be deceiving. No one ever. I don't know, man. A lot of people getting frustrated with the game. We'll see how this plays out with the limited secret lair runs and play packs. I never understood these videos from Rudy. Ravnica Remastered boxes just released and are still dropping from pre-release prices, but because they didn't drop 50% in a few days, Post-release, the set is all of a sudden a massive success and is evidence of Magic making a miraculous recovery. 
he must have a special sale coming up involving modern sets that he's trying to prime the community for. Bye now, Rudy says it's good. Ravnica remasters, draft, and collector boxes are cheaper on eBay than some distributors. I don't think that is doing well, just my two cents. Thank God Metapoo is going to the moon. If the print runs are determined a year or so before release, how could they cut them as fast as Rudy is speculating? Aren't they just piled up in a warehouse? I don't care if the latest product is going to be stable. I am, bro I am too broke from all the other products that will take years to recover just to the price I paid for it. Rudy, you're starting to look like Nicholas... <laughs> Nicholson's Joker. When prices go up, Timmy buys, and when markets go down, Timmy sell. I'm glad you, your buddies, were able to buy all the Amazon dumps so they never hit the market, but it's now worrying that the market is quite manipulated because a few people have all the boxes. These boxes should never have been printed. We need serialized boxes. MTG has bottom, MTG has turn, MTG has shown bullish tendencies. Magic market data is amazing, MTG to Mars this time. Rudy told us to invest in Meta Zoo. Meta Zoo did shoot past the moon and land in the lake. I just purchased a case of Baldur's Gate Collector for $140 a box literally 5 minutes ago. That's the lowest I've grabbed it in a while. Facts don't matter. In my feels, magic is dead. Laugh out loud. Rudy pumping AF. Whoa, bro. It's been 2 hours. When's the next video? Florida man spends 25k on TCG player to purchase pump select MTG product, then report the market has turned and is amazing to his Timmies, who then in turn start purchasing tons of product from Florida man, lightening his heavy bags to the Timmies. A wise $25,000 investment for Florida man will probably do it again. It works so well. There's a Timmy born every minute, PT Rudy. Look, I am broke as fuck. I went from the 9 to 5 hustle to being minimal wage, broke AF, MF, right? Um, yeah, this guy should not be investing in cards. Wake up, people. Don't listen to him. I wonder if he would take his own advice if he wasn't in the position he's in. Well, Rudy, here are some of your sealed investment current liquidity rates. Uh, and then it goes on buy list, which is really bad. Who would buy past collector's boxes for 300 plus? I can't see this happening in the future. Lowe's, market is still dead in Europe. There's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong. Cardboard Jim Cramer. Heavy bag, Rudy. Sell your 401k. Buy cardboard from this guy. It's an investment. One half a pallet is Rudy speak for four pallets. Rudy wears diapers. Rudy is feeling better, so he's going to pump and dump your ex. Coffeezilla is investigating you. You know, like, it's not a good sign, guys, when coffee, when your comments include Coffeezilla. Uh, it's typically, like, you know, it's not good. I think Alpha Investment knows that. I mean, it's not good when people are sending your shit to Coffeezilla. Um, because even on the off chance that he does investigate on it, yeah, you know your life will be done. It's pretty sad. Ramlicka remaster sucks. I wouldn't buy it. 